Здорово тебе, здорово, Джонатану. Здорово. Всему, что я вижу, вижу, я очень холодно тут. Вот. Так, короче, продолжаем. Разгрею руки, а то пиздец, холодно. Так, вы с ума. Кто там? Кто? Чё? Чё там пизданули? Так, куда мне идти? А, точно, мне надо найти эту девчулину. Так. А здесь вот еще. Кстати, это пока я шел. О... Я. Информация. Кто это? Кланс. Просто. Я, короче, э, отдал отцовские часы, которые нашел этому Освальду нашему. Нашему домовому. Подарок. My God! So you survived the war too? So sorry, I didn't recognize you at first. Well, I almost didn't recognize you either. War does that to men, I heard. In my case, it was true, for I witnessed the horror that lies underneath. Yeah. When did you escape the war and return to London? You know what's funny? I almost never think about the war. Not anymore. I'm involved in another kind of battle now. I know what you mean. I haven't had much time to think about the war either since my return. Of course. With the epidemic, I bet you've been busy as well. Forgive me, Johnny. I, I didn't want to sound selfish. What is this new battle? Well, I saw terrible things during the war. Horrors I thought I'd forget. They're here too. They're everywhere. Vampires. Vampire. Он подозревает нас в Добросите, ты что? Clarence. Why have you distributed leaflets about vampires all across the West End? I have to warn everybody about them. They've killed thousands of people already. Unnoticed thanks to the epidemic. We are all in danger here. Vampires in London? Come on, Clarence. Who's going to believe that? I'm not mad, Jonathan. You have to believe me. I know they are real. They're all around us, even as we speak. Clarence, you've always been a reliable and a good friend to me. If you say you saw a vampire, then I believe you. Thank you, Johnny. Thank you for your trust. You don't know what that means to me. It's all right. But if you want my help, you have to explain exactly what happened. The first time it was in Rouen. I saw an officer drink the blood of a soldier. I saw its teeth. I saw it. Bite. It was a vampire, Johnny, and, and they're here too. Yochte. Vampire убивший жертву, когда служил во Франции. Ёбаный ты в рот. Кстати, вот я мигрин на It's a little late for visiting hours, don't. Не, блять. What can I say? 
I haven't lost my old habits. I hope we're talking about the same habits, old friend. Yo. Tell me what you have discovered about vampires, Clarence. They've always been here. And if you search for long enough, you realize others know about these devils too. I'm not alone. Ну вы помните, да, мне там надо было что-то 32 уровень, что, чтобы канализация здорового козла убить? The Brotherhood of St. Paul's Stole, Ichabod Throgmorton. Those names always pop up when you dig deep enough. Have you spoken with any of them? No. With the quarantine, it's almost impossible to leave the West End. But as a doctor, maybe you could, Johnny. Are you asking me to help you prove the existence of vampires, Clarence? Yes, Johnny. Please, gather all the information you can find about vampires and bring it to me. You're the only friend I have left. I need you. Странный ты. Clarence, tell me about the vampire you saw in France. I was enjoying my leave in Rouen. I left the bar, took a shortcut back to the barracks. I saw it in a back alley. An officer in a stained uniform biting into a soldier's neck. Did you ever see that officer again? No. He wore the uniform of the Royal Warwickshire Regiment. I did some research but found no trace of him. He probably stole it from a previous victim. But you were drunk, weren't you? Are you sure these two men were not just kissing? Please don't insult me, Johnny. I hid, and I saw him leave. Then I saw the body, drained of all blood. I've seen the same marks here in London since I've returned. How is it with you? We've spent so much time away from each other, and so many things have happened. But you're alive. You returned in one piece, and you have a family. How many soldiers can say the same? Believe me, it's not quite that simple. Unlike you, I'm not the man I used to be. Is everything all right at home? Surely Venus was relieved to see you return from France in one piece. Have you forgot what people are like in this part of town, Johnny? Venus fears for our family reputation. Now her husband has become the village idiot. Ух ты, блядь, ты посмотри. You need some rest, Clarence. You should try to sleep. Так, а где я могу найти там Венеру, вот этих вот всех ваших полудурков, ну Шарлотта, о, о, о. It has been such a long time since I last went to the theatre. Good evening, sir. Please forgive me for disturbing you. I'm a doctor. I never judge a man by his title, but by his attitude. And you are not disturbing me at all. I am Calhoun Russell, and I welcome you. Well, I must admit it's good to receive a warm welcome for once. I'm Doctor... I'm Jonathan Reed. Welcome, Dr. Reed. Welcome to my humble shop. What can you tell me about this place? I recently found the best steak and kidney pie in the city. I'd be glad to share the address if you want. Finding a good restaurant 
Is that really all that interests you? Oh, I have many passions, but nothing brings me ecstasy like subtle and exquisite flavors from my teeth to my belly. Как он так сказал? I must confess, I have quite specific tastes when it comes to nutrition. Really? Well, I'm always happy to try new exotic meals. If you ever find an intriguing table, please share the address. Uh -huh. How is the situation in this part of town? Life is good and peaceful. We're lucky to live in such an era of progress and wonders. Are you not concerned about the epidemic? Oh, I'm sure the authorities would take the appropriate measure if the danger were that high. Are you that blind? I've seen hundreds of victims piled up in this city each week. Mr. Reed, please. Why are you so angry? I did not mean anything by it. Ah! Is it not a little too late to be trading? On the contrary, it is the perfect hour. Believe me, my friend, it is always at night that you meet the most fascinating characters. But what about the epidemic? The bombs and raids? And all the random violence? Please, sir, this is London, England. We will prevail. And if a bomb must fall on my shop, then I'll be there to hear it falling. So you prefer to work at night? Oh, I also enjoy a sunny day like everybody else. But the night always has a certain je ne sais quoi of its own. Так ты не хочешь заработаешь, если что. Люди обычно днем покупают вещи. Do you have any family nearby? Not since my parents died. I'm London's lone gourmet. Really? But you seem to be such a pleasant and sociable fellow. I'm afraid the real hedonist has to be sometimes. I discovered ecstasy as a solitary pleasure, but it does not mean it can't ever be shared. London's lone gourmet. What a strange title. I used that name in my early years when I was a food critic, and I kept it. I may oh, have the your goods, Mr. Russell. Травушки, муравушки, вот такие вот штучки мне нужны. на расследование так сейчас я еще здесь посмотрю нужно больше людей найти А это куда вход? В канализацион? Уселась, блядь? Good evening, miss. Can I help you? I'm a doctor. Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am... I am... 
Karina Billow. I don't need any doctor. The rats. Where are the rats? Miss, you don't seem well at all. Are you afraid of rats? Has one bitten you? No. It's me who bites them. Tasty, juicy, disgusting rats. I can't stop eating them. Help me, please. Help me to disobey the voice. Going через Карине Белову. Tell me about yourself, Miss Billow. What do you do for a living? Oh, I'm hungry. Need to eat. Have you got something for me? Blood, perhaps? Can you give me blood, Dr. Reed? Don't you remember who you are, Miss? What you did for work? I was strong, proud. I campaigned for good causes. But that was before. Before. It does not matter anymore. I'm so hungry. What happened to you? The rats. The answer hides in their little crunchy bones. Their juicy, tiny brains. Miss Billow, please, try to concentrate. Why do you worry about rats so much? The voice in my head. He forces me to do so. Drink their blood, he said. Eat their flesh. Do you feel compelled to obey that voice, Miss Billow? Even if you're loath to submit to it? Yes. Please. Help. Tell me about the voice in your head. Who is it? Can you describe it? Is it someone you know? Someone you met? Keep your mouth shut, he said. Don't ever speak about me or I'll abandon you. Help me, please, doctor. Так, Ришкин становится нет, что тогда, когда она говорит о том, что с ней произошло. What is the local news here about, Miss Billow? Shadows. Shadows hunting shadows. Whispers in the dark. Pestilence. Suffering. Death. I must go now. Goodbye, Miss Billow. Кашли нахуй. Маски носи. И не перди. Венера красная. Ладно, поговорим с Венерой. Тук-тук-тук. Hello? Is anyone there? Jonathan. Is that you? I did not know you were back in London. Oh, my dear Johnny, I'm so sorry for your loss. Mary was such a sweetheart. Thank you, Venus. May I come in? I was going to bed, actually. No. Forgive me. With the epidemic, I tend to forget people are supposed to sleep at night. I'll tell you what. Come back tomorrow for tea. I'll be glad to see you then. <laughs> Завтра на чай. Ой. Так, что он откроет сейчас дверь? О, есть. Так, я на месте, да? Uh, 
Um, Как же мне туда забраться? Ну же по идее я могу. Или чё? Чё он? Чё он не хочет туда прыгать? Или это именно только из этой надо? Если это так, то это ебать какая тупость, нахуй. То есть я должен сначала проникнуть в один дом, чтобы потом, блядь, проникнуть во второй дом. А это ли не глупо? Обосраться просто. Если я к Венере попаду, то потом там на дверь. Да это пиздос какой-то, блядь. Мне вот это последняя глава, или это может не последняя, но вот это мне вообще не, не нравится, этот район. Во-первых, враги. Уровни, наверное, 12 выше. Внезапно, блядь. ресторан То есть, как мне это искать?
Так, я пока на сюжетку не хочу идти. Я хочу еще немного побегать. Поразгадывать, деда, чё. Ладно, давайте мы туда сначала. К вот этой точке, да? Так, ресторан Да ты чё за хуй такой? Да как же это накаляет меня уже? Иди ты нахуй. Серьезно? I'm sure Kaloon Russell has no interest in such a conventional menu. Так, это все откидывается. Теперь нам надо идти назад. Thank you. 
так. И... Нет, не показалось. Так куда ты? Не надо нам сюда. Отличная была комбинация. Прям потрясающе. Так, следующий. Так, туда. Там что-то пропустил. Ну, нахуй. Всем дерьмо все. Теперь здесь где-то надо искать. Понятно, что там надпись Ресторан. И рядом возле него это меню. Так, все, я в точке. Ищем Ресторан. Так. А вот ресторан. I'm sure Kaloon Russell has no interest in such a conventional menu. Я пошел туда в жопу, блядь. Сука. Серьезно? Так, я на месте. Вот 26 как как куда? Хуя. Иди ты нахуй.
О. Подожди, это что за здание? Иди нахуй. Блять, мужик. уже сиди да блять Да, блядь. Наконец-то, блядь. Какой ты пиздец. Так, а это что куда? Старшим человеком выяснить, как дела. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. Do you need help, sir? I think I'm fine. But what happened to my jailer? Be careful. He's as vicious as he is strong. You don't have to worry about him anymore. What happened here? I am Tadao Kimura. I was imprisoned by this lunatic for several days. I thought I was going to die here. You're not going to die now, Mr. Kimura. If you hurry, you should be able to get home safely. It seems that I owe you my life. You have all my gratitude, Dr. Reed, since it is the most precious thing I possess. Goodbye, Mr. Kimura. Take care. Kimura, please. А почему какие блять звезды сошлись вы, сука? У меня было расследование вот это. У меня это бесит. Почему на само все переключает мне? Тварь такая. Fresh water. 
As long as it's not holy water, I may find some use for it. Полить цветок. И дадут очевон, ты посмотри. А, я нашел эту воду. И теперь я. Мне долго бежать, чтобы цветок полить. Так, ладно, ищем дальше. Ресторан. Конечно же. A restaurant where the guests are blindfolded before being seated. Intriguing. Все? Так, а кто это там был сверху? I cannot enter. Хорошая двухстолка. Взял куда-то двухстолку. Четыреста тридцать два, да? Это вот. А. М -м. Ну круто. Дверь вот открыта. Просто забыли дверь закрыть. Вот и все. Давайте в этом не будете охуевшего уровня. Попал все
все, все. Последний текст по Бралю. Блять. Я правильно вышел? Нет, неправильно я вышел. It's locked, all right. Так, пойдем сообщим о меню. Потом надо будет вернуться в больницу, а от больницы, блядь. Ладно, я сейчас не буду весь этот путь. Записывать просто кусками. Чук-чук и все. Потому что капец как долго будет. Good evening, Dr. Rahid. A great night, what? Дивная ночь, ага. Очень, блядь, чудесно. I have found a restaurant that could satisfy you, Mr. Russell. The most intriguing and exotic restaurant in London. Really? You have piqued my interest. Where is it? It's a place where you eat in complete darkness and try to identify your meal without anything but your palate. My, oh my! How interesting! It could even be fun to eat a little poisson et fruit that way. Oh, oh thank you, Dr. Reed. Please, have this for your research. Goodbye, Mr. Russell. Так, ага, все, давай, Mr. Russell. Так, смотри. А, бля, бля, бля. Расследование, да? Иди там не искать. Или мне просто это типа... По, 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 по... Да. Это так. Это чтобы мне надо в другой дом попасть, что не знаю. А здесь, блядь, дочь всего отца. А здесь капец. Так. Ну вот это давай сейчас пойдем. А, как нам туда проще по... Да, блядь, гос... А. Поверху, да? Сейчас поворачиваем, там поверху переходим. Сюда, да? Правильно, правильно.
Pra voltar isso. Good evening. How can I? Yeah, ni chera. A gun, al. Так, сверх. Mr. Evening. Since I took well, help. In fact, what? How are the way this? Si Have you heard anything about Nurse Crane? And her dispenser. Not really. A man such as yourself, knee deep in the muck of Whitechapel, must know more. Speak now. Yeah, thanks to Nurse Crane's dedication, these foreigners keep coming to Whitechapel, and my lodgings welcome all. So business is booming. More than ever. Hope Nurse Crane's dispensary does nothing but flourish. More money in my pocket in the end. Why am I not convinced? Maybe it's because you lack faith. Being a skeptic must be useful for a man of science. Goodbye, man. Taking up my father's business. You goodbye. Tak, Muka. Good evening, Harry. May I show? Is there any pain and suffering in this world? So, I'm not bothered. Do you need any? Yes, sir. Not yet. Carsten. You've hum. Так. Have you? I don't believe a miracle. Не не не. Goodbye, young. Even my dreams are soaked with gloom. Fancy, but you never. Так. Goodbye for. It's for. How is the sanitary situation? Don't you hear the trumpets? Aha! Well. Tell me the reason why you despise Joseph Larrabee so much, Tobias. A faithless shepherd is the worst criminal. For he leads his flock to the abyss by the path. God smote this man, for he doubted. I only met him briefly, but he seemed a dedicated man who tried to provide guidance. Do you not believe in punishment, my son? I am not talking about the law of men. I am talking about judgment from heaven. I believe that we are, as men, our own judges, juries, and executioners. Armageddon is upon us, Dr. Reed. The final battle where every soul will be weighed. I'm afraid yours will burn for a long time. Так, ничего нового я не узнал. Блять, блять, сука! А так жрать хочется. Don't you fight? No doubt you're blessed by your generosity, man. I have had. No. Good evening. How are I always? And you're not empty. Do you need a sandwich? 
If you thank you. Goodbye. Ты тоже вы заебали. Что вы делаете? Do you need any? It... I'm forget. Goodbye. Так, не сюда. I cannot enter. Так, кстати. Угу. Выебал. Я тебя выебал, нахуй, не выебал. Так, и последний текст. Good evening, Mr. Swan. Is it you? Да, да, да. What can I do for you, doctor? Так. Your sister seems to believe this miracle elixir business is somehow doing you good. Loretta believes that keeping busy is what I need to be happy. And is she wrong? My sister is wrong about almost everything. But as long as she thinks she's in charge, she can be nice. Here is another page of the diary we were talking about. Ah, now we're talking. Ingredients? Dosages, dangers, and side effects, this is it. Is the diary complete now? No. The author tested his work in a hidden laboratory. We must find out where it was. Please, find me more pages, Doctor. The... Goodbye, Mr. Swanborough. I'll leave you now. Tell me. How do you see the world these days? Um, чего, блядь? Так я же мотнюсь. What can I... You seem unwell, sir. Actually, I... Yeah, thank you. Goodbye, man. Wandering in this part of town at night, you're either brave or a fool.
так. Так я же ему ее отнес. Ч она не. Почему она не засчиталась? Э, блядь. Алло, игра на. Четыре из четырех, нахуй. Она... Может, мне типа надо отдохнуть? Столету лучше чужие. Сколько у нас очков? Тысячи там, да? С хером. Подожди, как отмена? В смысле уже не восемь. А у меня чей уровень упал?
Так. Так. А, эффективно использовать свои когти, и теперь уж удар улучшает врагов. Вынести же такую глубокую рану, что при каждом попадании получает кровь противника. Стоимость 20, остальные 3. 3 секунды. Стоимость 20. Кровь 300. Чем обычно? с кровью. Здорово, да? Угу, 
немножко тыры-пыры туда-сюда. Неужели, блядь, зато Good пиво? Evening, Mr. Swanbra. Is it you, dog? Wandering in this part of town at night, you're either brave or What can I do? Goodbye, Mr. Swanbra. I'll leave you now. Она реально затопила. Tell me. How do you see the world? Иди нахуй. Вот что я тебе скажу. Значит, мы отсюда уходим. Из этого дерьма ебаного. И пойдем. В больницу нам надо. Да ты ж заебал мне. Да господи. Вот 
Все, заодно уровень покачаем, да? Да, блядь, четвертая. Так, надо укус повысить и кровь. Смотри, ачивка сейчас будет. Done. И. А что, ачивки нету? Полиции ток. Никого за это ачивку дают. Хуйня какая-то. Так, короче, идем по сюжету уже. запасть о да блять ну господи заебал Так, не хочу. Типа, а как мне сделать? А, вот, точно. Один, два, три. Он 
помочь пытался, вы и нахуй. Все, идем на главную миссию, нам надо качаться, блять, а у нас пиздец вообще. Сейчас каждая тварь меня ебашит, но крысы. Ну что, знаешь, придется поверить в это. Да, господи. How is the situation in the West End? I've heard rumors about armed men patrolling and fighting infected citizens in these very streets. I was lucky they didn't shoot me when I was abducted. May I ask you what you do for a living, Mr. Kimura? I am... I was... a landlord. A wealthy one. And... not a very kind one, I realized recently. Why this sudden epiphany? Is it because of your near-death experience? Well, I was already feeling nostalgic about Weymouth, my hometown. With recent events, I'm thinking about going back there. Tadao, богатый до молодец, тоскующий по родному городу. Так, что у нас здоров? What can you tell me about your abduction? If you really want to know, I was locked in that building for three or four days. My jailer was insane, mumbling about sacrifice and voices. And why didn't he sacrifice you? That was the weirdest part. He claimed to spill blood was not enough. It had to be done when some stars were aligned. Which stars? That's the whole point. He wanted me to talk to him about some Red Queen configuration or constellation. I've never heard of such an astronomical term. Vampire pahitel Tadao was pozvosh sivo starostyu. Astar... Astarastyu, blet, starostyu, k astronomii. What did he say about voices? He constantly whined about the voice of his master, ordering him to do terrible things. He wanted to silence the voice by offering blood. My blood. Why are you so nostalgic for your hometown, Tadao? I was focused so much on making money, I almost forgot that my relatives and friends are threatened by this epidemic. Have you heard anything from your family? I was not only a bad landlord, I was also a bad husband. I've not seen my wife and son for years. Busy, busy, busy. At least now you're ready to go back. Так, тогда брось свою семью и уже много лет не видел сына. Хорошая папашка. Don't be surprised if your son bears a grudge, sir. You make it sound like you suffered from an absent father yourself, Doctor Reed. Well, I'll keep your warning in mind. Have you no friends at all? Over the years, I'm afraid my greed turned me into my friend's adversary, while I became friends with my professional rivals. Those you grew up with didn't share your views on money and success. Would you believe I was once a member of poetry circles and an astronomy club? We were young, such joyful dreamers then, that I stopped laughing long ago. Uh -huh. Сожрать я его не могу, и он ни с кем не связан. Ты сидеальная жертва. Can you change? And is it what you really want? If so, 
It must come from within, not without. I've seen what an altruistic gesture can do. Nothing forced you to save me, Dr. Reed, but you did. I will follow your example in these matters from now on. There is no need to thank me. Rescuing a London citizen should not be out of the ordinary. Though I'm afraid it may appear so in these difficult times. You did not only rescue me, you fought for me. You put your life in danger to save me. That's quite extraordinary. How will you cope if you're attacked again? I don't know. I've heard about these men and women who patrol the West End every night, chasing criminals like my abductor. Maybe I should join them. Uh, Бороться с вампирами после того, как с ним. После того, что с ним произошло. Ну я-то тебя, сука, спас. Ты решил против меня пойти. Tell me, Tadao, why was your abductor so interested in your passion for astronomy? I don't know. We met a few times at the Royal Greenwich Observatory. He seemed to share my hobby. Then he invited me to his house and locked me in. Yes, astronomy is a fascinating subject. When I was a child, my mother bought a small telescope for my sister and I. We spent many a pleasant evening stargazing. Stars are not just dots in the sky, Doctor. They are the key to our understanding of the cosmos. They remind us how insignificant we are. You're right. But children love magic and stories. I remember our mother told us constellations have the power to protect us. Protection by the light of the stars. That's sweet. You remember the name of these constellations? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pegasus. It was the constellation my mother liked the most. Memory's a strange thing. I can recite without hesitation the names of the 88 constellations. Yet I barely remember my own childhood. Did he fake his interest in astronomy to get close to you? No. In his madness, he spoke about a blood sacrifice to be made to his master when the stars aligned to a specific configuration. Звезды сойдутся, блядь. Читаны выйдут на свободу. Вот это. Goodbye, Mr. Kimura. Take care. Maybe I should leave the city. Так. А ты кто? Ну давайте нас позвали на какой-то совет. Закончим, потому что что-то я долго сижу. Сколько бегали впустую туда-сюда, блядь, из-за цветок вонючий, нам ничего не дали даже. А я его полил. Do you know where you are standing right now? In front of the Ascalon Club, I presume. The Ascalon Club only summons or ostracizes. What is your business tonight? I received an invitation. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. Welcome to the Ascalon Club, then, Dr. Reed. Please proceed. Lord Redgrave is waiting on you upstairs. Welcome to the Ascalon Club, then, Doctor. There has been quite a battle here. I'm sure the Ascalon Club has the money to replace the furniture.
А, это вот задний, да, вход? Я мог бы проникнуть. Ты прикинь. I cannot enter. Мне бы вот этот меч взял. Бомжатник вообще. Ой, ковер, у меня такой же был. И на полу. А чё? Иногда ощущение, что все вот эти ковры, они, блин, одинаковые. Во всем мире, да, вот ковер, ну. My good friends, if I may have your attention, behold our visitor, the good Dr. Reed, newborn of blood so pure and strong that even my friend Fergal Bancher was no match for him. Here, here, here. Come forward, young Eklund, for we have so much to discuss. Welcome to the Ascalon Club, Dr. Reed. I am Lord Redgrave, Earl of Bristol and Chairman of this exclusive association. Lord Redgrave. At last we meet. I have been eager to make your acquaintance. I have heard some astounding things about you. Please accept my condolences for your loss, Dr. Reed. Thank you, my lord. Lady Ashbury expressed your wish to meet me. Yes. The lady has always been a useful acquaintance, though not always reliable. Is she a good friend of yours? Mm. Yes, she is. I may even say I admire her probity and her kindness. She has helped me since I was reborn. Hmm. The centuries have taught me never to trust a woman completely, especially if she is immortal. Too prone to emotions, if you ask me. Too fickle when it comes to important decisions. My lord, do not expect me to speak ill of Lady Ashbury. Of course not, and I praise your loyalty. Would you offer the same fidelity to the Empire? What do you mean? I speak of this skull plague that threatens London and the country. You have been on the front line in the East End. But the time has come to open up a second front here. The epidemic has escaped the quarantine. You have new cases of the outbreak. We don't know for certain. But we cannot allow the disease to threaten the prominent heads of Great Britain. Hmm. Why are you suddenly so friendly? The last time I met one of yours, he tried to kill me. Are you referring to Fergal? He was the most useful of servants, but he was just a servant. You, on the other hand, Doctor, proved yourself much more worthy. You want me to find possible sources of the outbreak in the West End? Is that it? Ah, straight to the point, like all eager newborns. 
We shall have time to talk about all this, Dr. Reed. But first, I should like to get to know you better. Talk? Is that the only reason you asked me here? Well, no. I also wanted to meet the intriguing Ekon who made such a powerful progeny of his sister. You have not learned the name of your maker, am I correct? Damn. No, I haven't. Have no embarrassment, Dr. Reed. We all make mistakes. But whatever your lineage, you are definitely Ascalon material. What do you mean? I would like you to become a member of the Ascalon Club and to serve me as such. Before I accept, I have so many questions. Please ask. What is the Ascalon Club's express purpose? We follow the credo of William Marshall, the greatest knight who ever lived. As was he, we are sworn to protect the British Empire. What does Ascalon mean? Ascalon was the lance wielded by St. George, glorious patron saint of England when he slew the dragon. And like that lance, we pierce the hearts of all our nation's enemies. William Marshall founded the Ascalon Club. Not exactly. William Marshall granted me immortality, and I founded the club a few years later. The good knight has been gone for so long. What does it mean to be a member of the Ascalon Club? It means that you swear to protect the interests of the Crown, that you become a loyal servant of the British Empire. Do you have any official recognition from the government? A charter from His Majesty the King? No. Of course, the Ascalon Club publicly supports the Empire, but the true nature of its members remains a secret. Am I supposed to follow orders? As founder and chairman of the club, I alone am entitled to make demands of our members. And I do appreciate obedience. I killed Fergal, who claimed to be one of yours, sent to cleanse the East End of all Skulls. Will his death be an issue? Do not worry. My priorities have changed. Fergal was a zealous servant of mine, but like any servant, he had his limitations and is readily replaced if necessary. Ты решил заменить его на меня, да? Мразь ебаная. А нет других, да, вариантов? I agree to join the club. This is good news. Good news indeed in these crucial times. Let's inform the assembly formally and proceed with your initiation. My initiation? Fear not. Nothing fancy nor dangerous. It is just that we, the members of Ascalon, believe that tradition and custom are the backbone of this country. My fellow members, dear friends, please gather and welcome this Ekon as one of our own. Is he worthy? Is his blood pure? Well, speak, Dr. Reed, in front of the most sacred blood. The blood of our beloved William Marshall, speak now. Will you serve and protect the crown as he did? Yes, I will. Then, young Ekon, it is time to testify with your blood. It is time to sign the Book of Allegiance. I know it's awfully gothic and a tad pedantic, but England's traditions are the backbone of our nation. Чем, что там думает так долго? И музыка какая-то играет. Как будто у меня есть какой-то выбор.
Welcome to the Ascalon Club, Dr. Reed. Take your place among the bearers of the lance. One of us! One of us! Теперь что мне с ними сейчас разговаривать? А это все, вот они все, да, вот эти, тоже нет. I thought it was Fergal coming back. No, no. Okay, he's slowed down the range. He barely spoke English. That went well, did it not? It is always useful to bolster the troops' morale. Especially before a difficult battle. You have the makings of a general, my lord. I was, though very long ago. Well, not quite a general, but a proud defender of the crown. So why did you really want to meet me? Straight to the point again, young Ekon. All right, let's talk, you and I, Lance Sparer. I'm listening, my lord. According to my spies, you have worked with Dr. Edgar Swansea on the epidemic. And your findings were quite alarming. Damn. You are spying on me. Not personally. I rarely leave this oh, place. But once he found you, Fergal kept me informed. Until you put an end to his mission. Who was Fergal? I don't see him sipping tea with the others in the club. Fergal Banshaw was my squire of sorts. Even before becoming that magnificent prince, he served me well. No, I mean, what was he? He was clearly no ordinary vampire. No, he was a Volkod, all muscles and instinct. Quite the rare breed, ferociously territorial. Mortals often mistake them for werewolves. You do know I killed him. Yes. Will you bear ill will towards me for his death? Of course not. Your victory was quite impressive and courageous. You earned my respect. Do you know Edgar Swansea? Not personally, but I have been told he has some sort of immortal fetish and is a good friend of yours. Does it bother you that I consider him my good friend? As long as you reveal nothing of the club's inner workings, why should I forbid you engaging in conversation with the good Dr. Swansea. Yes, I'm convinced the recent invasion of frenzied scowls in London is directly linked to the epidemic. This is not the Spanish flu, but something else. I would be glad to hear more of your discoveries, Dr. Reed, but for now, my main concern is the security of London's inhabitants, both mortal and immortal. What do you mean? Alarmed by the epidemic, the guard of Prewen has started a war against us British vampires. To appease the situation, we must eradicate the Skulls. Have you heard the rumors of some horned vampire revealing himself and singing obscure songs around the city? What is this new malevolence? Skulls are hostile vectors of contagion. That is a fact. But first and foremost, they are victims. I agree, Dr. Reed. Most of the new scales who roam the streets at night used to be good British citizens, but they must be put down nevertheless. So, what do you want me to do? I want you to investigate the city thoroughly. I have reason to fear there are cases of contagion in this part of town. Our absolute priority is to find and cleanse them. And how would you like me to proceed? By all means necessary, Dr. Reed. You are now a member of the Ascalon Club and you have carte blanche. Interrogate the locals, follow all the leads you find, and get results. Ring of Nose. Pavushan. Так, family portrait. 
Расспросить местных о потенциальных источниках инфекции в Эстэнде. В Эстэнде. Good evening, Dr. Reed. How does it feel to be this evening's centerpiece? Figuratively. It's quite unsettling. As a doctor, I am more used to being the observer than the subject observed. Do not be alarmed. The Ascalon Club has a tried and tested policy for choosing its initiates. May I ask who you are, sir? Why would you be interested? Well, as you seem to be the only man in the room with a beating heart, you draw quite a bit of attention yourself. Ah, vampire senses never cease to fascinate me. They dwarf those of mere mortals. I am Aloysius Dawson, by the way. Are you not afraid? You are surrounded by vampires. Sir! It's for that very reason that I joined the club in the first place. Is not the nature of this club a secret shared by only a privileged few? My dear Dr. Reed, I have spent years and a fortune precisely to gather that kind of information. So you asked for membership? I have been a member of many clubs in many countries. But I must admit, this one is my favorite. Club. Это секта. Are you a member of the club? Yes, I am. And I have been for many years. And will be until the day I die. What can you tell me about it? It's not really my place to give you such information. I am merely a mortal member. And a dying one of that. Are you sick? Personally, I consider my advancing years are a sickness in itself. My body is slowly abandoning me, Dr. Reed. What can you tell me about Lord Redgrave? I would not dare speak of our chairman without his consent. Mr. Dawson? of Dawson and Dawson, the wealthiest man in England. It is a pleasure to meet such a prominent figure of London. A withering London figurehead, to be precise. Are you sick, Mr. Dawson? I am a doctor, you know. My case is beyond the scope of traditional medicine. I have spent fortunes on the world's most competent doctors to arrive at that diagnostic conclusion. I'm sorry to hear that, sir. Should I suppose that you're here in search of some form of immortality? Absolutely not. I'm here to implement my plan to save the city I was born in. To cast out the ghastly evil that has us all on our knees. What is the situation like in this part of town? I am sure Lord Redgrave will enlighten you more effectively than I. What do you know about the guard of Prewen? I should not say this, but I admire their commitment. This is what the nation needs right now. But they are our enemies. They are not mine, Dr. Reed. Would you help them? No. There is a time for such methods. But brute force will not be enough to fight this plague. We have to think differently. Money cannot solve every problem. This mysterious epidemic is going to require more than money can buy. You're right. Money is nothing unless one has the will to wield it. I have a plan, sir. A radical one that will save all that is essential in London. What is your plan, then? Quarantine and barricades are futile. What we need is a wall. A formidable unscalable wall to isolate the deserving from the infected masses.
But that would segregate the rich from the poor, would it not? It would be unjust. Our only course of action must be to save England. And to save England, we have to make sacrifices. Are you not mistaking sacrifice for summary execution? Why do you care? Are you not a vampire? Removed from all mortal concerns? Decisiveness is what the city needs, and it needs it now. Have you heard the rumors of some horned vampire? Какие-то вы мрази тут все. Так, чем там 1600, да? А что надо? А, местных. То есть местные. What can you tell me about the Great Hunt? It's a major concern, and I'm convinced we'll only get Сколько a satisfactory conclusion дни, by putting an end to the epidemic. Сколько? I have already met Geoffrey McCullum. I am certain he will persist until he has killed every last vampire. The Guards' current successful recruitment campaign is driven by the ravenous behavior of the Skulls. I see. So without the epidemic creating scowls, the guard could not convince anybody of our presence. Exactly. Once we have put the epidemic behind us, we need only wait until the guard grows old and weak. Time will once again become our ally. What about the risk of a full-scale attack here? Geoffrey McCullum is a daring leader. That is exactly why so many of our number have left the country until things improve. But not me. I founded this club. I'll die defending it. You made me swear on the blood of William Marshall during my initiation ceremony. Why was that? William Marshall was the most glorious knight who ever lived. He served five kings and was a living example of probity for all. And he was my maker. William Marshall was a vampire. Is this some sort of joke? Wait. Could he be my maker? That would be joyful news. For it would mean he still walks among us. But alas, the great knight has left this world for good. Why is his blood so sacred to the Ascalon Club? He was simply the greatest defender of the realm we have ever known. I fought by his side at the Battle of Preston, and he made me his progeny following the fight. May I ask you about the mortal who attended my initiation, Mr. Aloysius Dawson? A member of the club does not normally ask questions about other members. We trust each other mutually. So he really is a member then? Indeed. Only the most eminent members are allowed to attend such ceremonies. Even if I admit some of us fled during the first hours of the Great Hunt. But Mr. Dawson is mortal. Are you not afraid he might reveal who you are? Especially to your enemies. Aloysius Dawson is a man of his word, as are all of us. This is the Ascalon Club, Dr. Reed. We do not grant access to the unworthy. Damn. Goodbye, Lord Redgrave. Godspeed, Dr. Reed. We are counting on you. Так, все, это, наверное, здесь они, никто больше ничего не знает. Поэтому их смело можно нахуй посылать. I think Lord Redgrave just suggested I was sired by an ancient vampire. Ни хуя он не намекал тебе. 
Так, надо сейчас с этим всеми пиздеть. Но это уже потом. Все, давай, счастливо. Пока тебе. Давай.